Hmm, just woke up. What time is it? 3 a.m. right now. Oh my god. Dang, 6 a.m. <laughs> it still blows my mind. 3 a.m. Good time to be alive. <laughs> Wait, do you have That's any prime like, time classes, Anthony? Right? If, if any really early classes? I do, I do. Uh, I had it like um, just now at. 11.30, so it's gonna be 8 a.m. for you guys. No, but for the, oh, 8 a.m. <laughs> That's... Did we um change this link to be whatever new form Andy wanted to put in? You wanna put he the use, like, He wanted to or... use this, this new form. Oh no, there's some that... Wait, why is Gabriel in there? He's not a co-host. I don't know why. Wait, does he have? I've already responded. Okay, never mind. Well, let's just start at twelve five anyway. Like not twelve because I don't see a lot of people here yet. We change this. I'm too lazy. Anything new with y'all? Got ignored. Thank you, QR code. And see meeting you too. You guys think we're going to have a big turnout? <laughs> just like so for half people. the people are officers. <laughs> just like five people. I, I went to um, IEEE meeting, uh, the really? general meeting. Yeah. And they only had like 23, if I recall. Like including officers? Including officers. Hmm. Is I trouble E like really big? Yeah, um, I would say it's pretty big. Um, they have, they basically have um, clubs. Like bigger in, than us? In, yeah. In, yeah. They were pretty older, more older than us too. So, yeah, you know. I know they're older, but I don't know. Because aren't they more, more like just EEs, right? It's like, basically, yeah, it's basically the, the organization for electrical or computer engineering mm. or electronics. I see, I see. Nobody wear a club shirt. Y'all are bad. <laughs> I'm cold. Yeah, exactly. It's cold. It's, it's too we need cold jacks. today. It's too it's cold. Harper, hey. Harper, are you wearing? Are you wearing it, Harper? That's why I'm saying. Okay, so you, then you should just go like this so that we can just see it. No, 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 no. That's why I mean, we need a hoodie, Harper. That's why we need a hoodie. Yeah, I'm, but we got to put on a hoodie so that, like, you know, we could be warm. Okay, I'm gonna start admitting yeah. everyone. Let me just tell them like we've been in five minutes. Of the club. Okay, <laughs> I'll start admitting everyone. Are you having to send me my shirt? Harper has it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. 
Is Harper supposed to send it to you? It... I'm not gonna send it to you. <laughs> Hello guys, we'll start in five minutes. We'll be still gonna wait a few more minutes for uh, people who are gonna join. Hi. Hello. 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 Yeah, we can. Uh, we'll start in a couple minutes, giving people some time, more time to come in.
Okay, we'll get started. Um, so first we just have your sign-in link for you guys that are already members of the club. Those who are not members, you can sign up on the left QR code. Give you guys a few minutes for that. Okay, Dakota. Yo, 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 what's going on everybody? Um, we're gonna do a little icebreaker. Uh, sorry, I don't have a camera. I'm still trying to find a decent one from Amazon, but like all of them, like you say something and then 10 minutes later, your mouth matches the same thing. So still looking for webcam. Um, but my icebreaker question for y'all today is, what's your quarantine hobby now? What's your new quarantine hobby? Like you could say before quarantine, you would go, I don't know, skydiving, or you go test different restaurants ambiances. Well, you can't really do that anymore. So either like unmute yourself or you drop it in the chat. What's your new quarantine hobby? What are you doing when you're stuck indoors? I'm curious. Um, for me, it's mostly sleeping, occasionally draw, play game, and practically a little bit of work on the Zoom bot. <laughs> Oh, let's go. Okay, okay. Let me see. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm remiss. I'm not reading, reading the chat. Cry? Yeah, I mean, <laughs> we've all been there. Am I right? Uh, losing my mind. Yeah, geez. It's been a hell of a minute. Uh, learning about long-term investing. Hey, that's a that's a solid investment. Can uh, you explain options to me? I just don't get options. Um, growing a garden. How's that going? I want to know how that's going. I hope everything's growing very fruitfully. Uh, play more video games and start a 3D printing. Oh, you got a 3D printer? That's sick. Tracking Dogecoin trends. Yeah, that's, uh, you know what? Dogecoin dipped down a little bit. Um, bummer. Uh, <laughs> the good old stomps. Skincare. Okay. Yeah, hey, yeah, you don't have to go anywhere. You got, if you got to sit in some skincare for a while, open to it now. Reading manga. What manga, Paige? That's the question. Which manga? Mm -hmm. Reddit, unfortunately, unfortunately, are you bummed about Reddit? What? Statics homework. Ooh, <laughs> just kidding. No, you should do your homework. You should all do your homework. Don't uh, follow anyone's example, uh, myself. Yeah, don't forget about the stonks, man. Oh, good, Gabrielle. I'm glad. I'm glad it's going well. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Thank you, Jake, for the correction. Fortunately, Reddit. It depends where you go. You know, don't uh, don't be going on some whack ass threads. Options is more of an in-between short and long-term investing. Okay, okay. So like, I have to pay attention actually to it. Too much Reddit isn't healthy. You should, <laughs> you should take your own advice. Hey, you know what? We got some other people in here making Zoombot, drawing things. You need to take some lessons. Reading DB. Oh, okay, Paige. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I like it. All right, y'all. Any other hobbies? Any other new hobbies? What you guys got? I design survival engineering compact projects. Um, can we get an elaboration? What's going on here? What are you surviving? What is this? Dakota, what's yours? Oh, shoot. Me? <laughs> well, um, that's a good question. Uh, probably got to say Warzone, man. Just playing Warzone on the PlayStation. Um, it's too addicting. And uh, I can't break out. So I got to see. Yeah, finding a new webcam should be my new hobby. <laughs> um some zoom bot i found a zoom bot thing i'll drop it in the discord if y'all are not on discord uh, you should join our discord and i'll drop a, a pretty sick little simple thing because i'll tell you right now i don't know hardware at all i'm a computer science major so zoom bot was kind of intimidating but i found a pretty simple tutorial and uh, i'll drop that in the discord so you guys can take a look at it it takes like 20 minutes maybe if that been learning some Raspberry Pi and Linux. That's a that's a good one. You have some valuable skills right there. <laughs> thank you, Anthony. Uh, oh, thank you for that link, Harper. 
Uh, Scott said, huge flashlights that act as a case for bit. Oh, that's a cool idea. Those are some big ass flashlights, huh? I like that though. Uh, but sorry, yeah. Hey, thank you everybody for sharing your, your hobbies with me. I appreciate it. I'm just curious. You know, I don't see anybody anymore. So um, yeah, thanks for sharing. So I know what everyone's doing. Uh, back to you, Allison. All right. Yes, uh, we are very excited to announce that we have officially published a brand new website for our club. Please check it out and we hope that you're going to like it. So yes, there's a lot of information about our project, um, what we are as a club, our officers and all that. Yeah, there's going to be a little chat box when you open the website too. Uh, Allison's going to be the one who answers your checkbox, but she will always answer you. Yeah, so if you guys do want to talk, I have it on my phone and I'll, I'll chat with you guys when you're on the website. So yeah, we hope you're going to like the new website. Yeah, we'll send an announcement about the website too, so you guys can look onto it more on your own time. Uh, Dawood? Hey guys, how's everyone doing? Uh, I just want to announce that we're going to have a career fair on Thursday, March 4th. So um, if you want to join, I also put a link up there. And uh, that's going to be a link for Handshake. So what's going to happen is that uh, this semester, you have to join through Handshake and uh, sign up for the uh, for the companies you're interested in. And uh, once, they, once you do that, they will just give you a specific date and at which they're going to interview uh, they're going to check your resumes and uh, if you do good they might even interview you so in order to get you ready for the resume workshop we're going to have like this uh, resume industry workshop on uh, this thursday where the uh, carl dominguez is like program manager at boeing and like uh, there would be five other officers that would uh, help you uh, get ready for uh, for this uh, uh, help you scan through your resume so uh, the way it's going to happen is that uh, when you originally join in, you're gonna be in the, you, you're gonna be in the waiting room like uh, like today, but then we're gonna have like five or six separate break rooms in which you'll be going in, and then you you can start sharing your uh, screen to show your resume to, to us uh, and Kyle to see how how it is. So if you guys are interested, please join us uh, this Thursday for for this resume industry workshop. And uh, also, I noticed that as uh, that last time we had an uh, industry workshop, some of, some of you guys had problem with the time timing or something. So we're gonna have like a Zoom poll right now to see like how 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 you want the things to be. So I'm gonna just uh, launch the polling right now. Please take it. Uh, Paige, will it be recorded? We haven't decided yet since um, a couple officers will be there to look over people's resume. We're not sure if people would want their resume to be like recorded, but you could always DM one of us if you can't make it and we can take a look at your resume if you'd like. We might record like the general part with Kyle maybe. No, you're fine. Yeah, but we might, we might not because uh, there, there's a chance that we, people are still gonna show his res, their resumes to him. So probably not. Yeah, if he has like anything general to say, we we might record it and then we'll just like crop it out, cut out the video. Yeah, I didn't tell you the time it's gonna be at two hour. Like most of our workshops are at two hour from uh, 12 to one on Thursday. We'll wait a couple more seconds. We're waiting on six people to vote. Five people. Yeah, let's just make it go for 30 more seconds. Okay, I guess I'm ready now. All right. So here's the results if you guys want to see, but uh, 
we'll start moving on. All right. Uh, I don't know if you guys heard, we have a club fair next week hosted by ESC on the ESC Discord. We did send out an email about it if you guys don't know how to get into the ESC Discord. But also, if you don't, you can message one of us if you, if you still don't get it. But it's going to be next, next Tuesday during U Hour. Uh, we'll be there. A bunch of other clubs will be there. If you guys want to come and support us. But also, I'm sure you guys heard everything that we're going to say there. But if you do want to come. Uh, All right, so if you've been working with your ZoomBot kit, or if you haven't, we had some winter time to think of if there's any additions we wanted to make to ZoomBot. So what we came up with is the ZoomBot light kit, which allows you to control individually adjustable LEDs for your Arduino using only three wires. And the kit's going to cost $5 and we'll bring everything you need to get them up and running. So I put a video here to kind of demonstrate what these lights actually do. And you can see how easy they are to program. For the ZoomBot Light Kit expansion, the new things you'll be getting is two meters of individually addressable LEDs, a five volt, two amp power supply, and a barrel jack to terminal converter. The rest of the things you'll need are already in your ZoomBot kit. Interfacing with the LEDs is pretty straightforward. All you'll need to do is connect your power jack to the power lines on the strip and connect three of the wires from your ZoomBot kit into the lights connector. With a simple breadboard setup like this, you can control all the lights in your light strand individually. On the programming side, we'll be delving into the Fast LED library in the Arduino IDE to make some animations for your light strips. Here's some examples of the animations we'll be going over. So the frame rate on that one doesn't do it full justice, just as you know, but the LEDs are super easy to program using, like I said, the fast LED library. Yeah, people keep calling them TikTok lights. I've been using these lights, like personally, since we did some stuff with the soccer bot and the table team, and they're a lot of fun. They're good to get into. And for example, the lighting I have right now for my green screen is powered by that strand of lights. So you can put them to use. Yeah, so they're gonna be an additional $5. So if you guys are already a member, you can just Venmo five bucks to William and then we'll, we'll get your name down and we'll let you guys know when we're gonna ship it out and everything. Right, uh, we do have elections coming up since it's second semester. We have an interest form that I will link out after the meeting. I'll show you guys what it looks like. So the form is just going to tell us what position you're interested in running in. And we're going to have you guys, there's a deadline on when to fill out this form. It's going to be Tuesday, March 9th. And then we are going to do elections. Like you're going to be giving your speeches starting tentative the week of the 23rd. And if you guys don't know anything about positions, I did send a message on Slack about this, but if you are unsure about if you want to run or if you are unsure about what a position does, you can ask any of us officers, you can DM any of us directly and we can explain anything or answer any questions that you guys have. And then we can also connect you to the right officer that you do if you wanna shadow someone beforehand. Uh, the, for Scott, the forms that are needed for you guys, we will be sending out an announcement after the meeting with all the information for the people that like missed the meeting. So we'll have that for you guys. But yeah, if anyone is unsure about elections or running, just can contact us. Yeah, we'll probably put them in Discord. Yeah. Anthony. Game night. We'll be organizing another game night on uh, next Friday on February 26th. I hope to see you all there. The games that we'll be playing is just um, Deckbox, Among Us, and Scribble. And if you have any requests of games that you guys want to try out, please uh, DM me on Discord. And yeah, it's on Discord, Dakota. And it's on February 26th. So I hope to see you all there.
last game night has been pretty fun. Um, I think it was a successful one. So I hope so. I hope to see more people on the twenty six. Thank you. Yeah, game night will be on Discord. All right, so we do have the sign up links for you guys again, and kind of the end of our updates. If you guys have any questions or anything, if you have not paid membership, you can use the sign up link, and it will say if you do want the LED package to add five dollars to your membership. But yeah. Anyone have any questions about the club or the additional LEDs or anything? I have a quick question. Um, is the fee yearly or um, based on semester? It's yearly. It's, it's per academic year. Ah, I see. Thank you. Uh, oh, so, so, oh, sorry. No, no, you can go. I'll, I'll say it in the end. Oh, okay, I, I was just going to ask, um, what, what are the perks of being a member versus being a non-member? Um, uh, the perks are that um, you get more resources as a member. So in this case, uh, sometimes uh, for our industry workshops, you might not be able to join unless you're a member because uh, we do check uh, if you're a member or not. And uh, like usually before we used to serve pizza, but like uh, Sally, because of uh, online, we can't do that. But uh, be, if you're a member, we share our resources, uh, you know, like you're not able to access the, the polls and stuff, not like not polls, but, uh, but, um, but like uh, our farms or like our discord, if you're not a member, you know, yeah, so to add on to that, uh, we do have Discord open to everyone. And then once you're a paid member, we do add you onto Slack. And all of our like tutorial videos or resources for any of the projects are posted on Slack only. So that if you're not a member, you don't really get those videos. And then additional to that is you do get a t-shirt and then you do get a Zoombot kit, which is just a kit of a bunch of components. And then we release videos based on that too, if that makes sense. Do you have more questions? Do you have anything else, Scott? I think, right? Uh, yeah. Um, yeah. Are elections like open to like members or to uh, to non-members as well? Or I'm just curious on that. Uh, we're gonna do members. For okay. Then... To be a member of club, but you can join to be a member of club at any time. Oh, okay, and then just Venmo William, right? I believe mm -hmm. that's who it was. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Uh, for, on that, I just wanted to tell you guys to like um, to do to, to do join us for elections and uh, sign up for positions because half of the office are gonna be leaving, so you had a pretty good chance to get a good position. Um, and, you know, please join and uh, it, and we you know shadow us to learn more about what we do and you know if you do that it would be much easier for you next year. And, and to see how things work. Yeah, you can shadow from now up into the forms are due to see what position you might want to run for. And then after you guys, after elections, when you guys get the positions, we do a mentorship program kind of to prepare you guys for your position. But also, if you're scared of running, I would say just go for it because a lot of us, this is our first year on board. So don't be afraid. And how many, uh, how many positions can people apply for, Allison? Uh, you can apply for as many as you want. We're just going to prioritize like the ones that need to be in the club first. So, you know, like do you need like a president, vice president, secretary, treasurer, but you can apply for as many as you want. Nice, nice, nice. Um, on that note, uh, I'm one of those seniors that is leaving the club, y'all. So if you would like to come shadow me at some point, uh, learn about the club in general, if you like, um, but more specifically, um, I handle like marketing. So like the Instagram or flyers or just whatever general purpose stuff, um, please come through and learn. I know we know a lot of technical stuff, a lot of engineering type majors. Um, but if you want to come have a good time and learn about like marketing side, maybe if you have a technical idea in the future, you can learn how to pitch it to somebody. Eh, eh, eh. So yeah, please come shout out me and uh, learn about marketing. Plus it's cool to put on your resume. So nice little resume builder, y'all. Yeah. 
I will also be leaving after this year, I guess. If you guys are interested, we can do a graduating senior Q&A. So we don't get any of like the, you know, everyone else, but especially for our seniors, if you guys have any questions, we can help you. Yeah. If you guys have any questions on like how to run or like what to do, you can you can you can ask us right now. But uh, you see, like many of the officer didn't have any experience and they're still doing great. Or or this new environment. You this... can pick the you can pick the brains of people who've been here before semester. Yeah. The people that have been here for a quarter. Yeah, I yeah. I was here for one year and quarter. I was here for quarter too. On the end quarter. But yeah, I think only like three or four of us officers are were officers last year. Everyone else is new. So don't be afraid to run if you guys are interested in a position or if you're just confused about what a position does. The form that we're going to send out does have descriptions of each one, but if you need more if you have more questions or you need more descriptions, you can let us know. And we'll answer whatever question you guys have. Uh, no position is gonna be closed. Like everyone that is an officer now, if they wanna run again, they have to run again. And if they lose to one of you guys, then they lose to one of you guys. So every single position is open. I'm gonna go through the website then, if no one has anything else. Oh, we do also have this promo video that Justin made that kind of showcases the club, if you guys wanna take a look at that later. So for updated website, you can just type cbprobotics.com. And the website has this little chat option if you guys want to chat with me because I get those messages. And we have a page for our projects. If you guys wanna look at all of our projects that we have. And then I think they go into more detail too. 